to introduce you to Jenny. She is my upline and she's one of the top people in Tropics. I'm also sat here with another two people in the background. That is Michelle and Steph. You can't actually see. <laughs> Hello. Um, so, <laughs> but you'll hear them. Um, so what we're talking to you today about is a company called Tropics. And I'm going to interview um, this lovely lady, Jenny, to she can teach you <laughs> about all you need to know about skincare and products that you're using on a daily basis that are really harmful. And we've got some amazing products here that are awesome. And uh, let's go over to Jenny and see what she's got to say about it. So tell us about Tropics, Jenny. Right, okay, so Tropic Skincare. Um, it's a company um, owned by a lady called Susie Ma. She's a little Chinese lady. And she has been interested in skincare for probably all her life. She's 28 years old now. But when she was 21, she went on The Apprentice. Okay. She didn't win it. She came third. But she was introducing on that programme. She was trying to get funding for the, the skincare brand, Tropic Skincare. There were only four products at the time. Um, and going backwards a bit, this girl used to live in China with her mum and dad and um, they moved to Australia when she was seven and she was surrounded by all these gorgeous plants and flowers and tropical um, you know fruits and things yep. and she started to make those products using those ingredients with her mum. Her mum's uh, very 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 interested in using natural products with no toxic chemicals in so as a child Susie was never put in a bath of anything with any chemicals in she put creams on that she'd made herself she washed her with shampoos that she'd made herself what a lucky girl very lucky mm. um so when Susie was 21 she went on to the apprentice um the reason she was allowed to go was that she'd started making i'll show the the ladies and gentlemen this product here which is our founding product it's called smoothing body polish and this is what her mum used to use on her to wash her with when she was a baby and when she was a child. Um, it's an exfoliating cleansing scrub. Um, it's completely 100% organic and it smells amazing. Now Susie doesn't use any harmful chemicals okay. in anything. So this has got salt, it's got lemon myrtle, it's got eucalyptus, it's got lovely grapefruit, lemon, lime. It smells amazing. It does smell amazing. And you rub this into your skin dry and then you stand in the shower or get in the bath and it rinses off and it leaves your skin covered in this gorgeous oil. So that was the first product, and just a little bit of information about how she first sold that. Um, when her mum and her were, um, they first came to England, they were really poor. They had to escape um, Australia from a not very happy ma relationship, marriage. Okay. Um, so this, this product was her way out because she took it to Greenwich Market. She made it in the kitchen in a big saucepan. And then she um, borrowed some water bottles from the gym at school wow. and some paper towels from the toilet. And she borrowed her mum's white china bowl and she was getting the, the ladies at the market to wash their hands with the scrub and then rinse them off and then she'd say, that's all your dead skin in the bowl. Oh wow, what a girl. So she actually sold, on her very first day, she sold uh, all 49 of the bottles that she had made. Her and how old was she? 15. 15, how and, amazing is that? And she gave her mum £980. Wow. And, and then she kept doing this after school every day and at weekends she'd make the products and sell them. And in three, six months, she'd saved fifteen thousand pounds for her mum. And in three years, she bought her a house. Wow! So they actually got out of the poverty that they were in. And Susie and her mum are still very close. So, yeah. going back to where I joined, I joined about two and a half years ago. We were actually then uh, there are about three and a half thousand ambassadors there. We called Tropic Ambassadors the people that do this. Uh, we're mostly women, but there are some absolutely gorgeous men doing this as well. It's oh, a really? unisex range. Okay. The range is for yeah, men and women as well, not just for, for women. Um, and I joined mainly because of the passion I have for not using toxic ingredients in my cosmetics. Um, I'm actually a nurse. My, my proper job has always been nursing. I've been doing nursing for 45 years. I still am a nurse. Um, yeah. I look after sick children. <clears throat> and I am passionate about making people better if they're not well. Yeah. That's why I do it. So my passion for these products stems from the fact that I know when people use them, there's no harmful toxic chemicals in them. And it is a unique brand which we can talk about. In and, and can you tell me more about the toxic chemicals that people are using on a daily basis? Like myself, I recently joined Tropics and I didn't realise about parabens and all the nasty stuff that I'd be putting on my body on a daily basis before I left the house. Um, and since finding out, it's shocking and I would like to share about those yeah well for me as well it's the it's the um the product ingredients in most cosmetics are things like parabens 
um, formaldehyde inducing in, in, uh, chemicals which are really bad for you um, there's all sorts of preservatives fragrance and perfume are probably the, the most one of the most toxic ingredients because it's completely unregulated so if a product says fragrance or perfume yeah then there's up to 3,000 different chemicals in there wow. not all of them are going to be toxic but yeah. probably around about 80 of them might be and products are rated and um, cosmetic ingredients are rated on a uh, a, a sort of list run by something called the Environment, uh, Environmental Working Group okay. and they look at ingredients and work, work out whether they're safe or not. Okay. Sadly the cosmetic industry uses products that are unsafe on a very regular basis. Parabens being the yeah, one that I was definitely. most concerned about because when I started my nursing career probably about two in, two in five people got cancer and now it's about one in two so yeah. the rate of cancer has gone up massively in the last 45 years since I since I actually um, became a nurse. And there is no doubt that it's the environmental chemical onslaught that we're exposed Definitely. to. I think people are, are shopping by a lot of price, like you have peril stores and things, and actually they should be looking at the ingredients they instead should. But, of. But they don't tell us um, no. is what's in it. So parabens are the most common, uh, widely used preservative okay. out there. They're in virtually every cosmetic out there. They're cheap. Yeah. It's ten times more expensive to put a, a, a natural preservative in than it is to put a paraben in. Okay. But unfortunately, these products go into our skin. You put something on your skin, 26 seconds later it's in your bloodstream. Wow. That's how HRT and nicotine patches work. They go through the, through the skin into the bloodstream. So if you've got a harmful ingredient, it'll go into the body. If you're lucky, the, the kidneys will get rid of it, and yep. the liver will get rid of it. If you're not lucky, it will stay in your body. And parabens are one of those... Um, chemicals that stay in your body so once they're in they never go okay. now parabens have been found in 98 percent of breast cancer wow. tumors uh, they open them up they put <coughs> parabens in they're found in 97 um, percent of americans have got parabens and other harmful chemicals in their bloodstream That's and true. they are completely unregulated so the word should be out there but it's not so what we what we have with um as one of our tools that we use is a, an app called Think Dirty. Yes. And it's a, an, a free app. Um, it's for any phone, Android or the other one. I don't know. Apple. Apple. And it looks like it's a little black box. It says Think yeah. Dirty. And if you download that onto your phone, um, it will rate the products from whether they're dangerous, okay, or not, or, or safe. Okay. It goes like a traffic light. So it's red, amber, and green. Okay. And the worst number you can have on the Think Dirty app is 10. Okay. The best one is zero. And what are our products? We're zero green. <laughs> or we Again. might be one or two. In fact, if I show on, on, um, on there, I don't know if you can see, this is the Tropic products. Lots and lots of listings. Um, but we're actually one of their top three out of ten. Um, two of our products are in the top ten. So how many products. companies in the UK are actually 100% natural, um, like ourselves, or is it... None. None. <laughs> really? In fact, we are a unique company. A lot of companies say natural as a word. Yeah. We are what we call 100% naturally derived in our core skincare. So everything that goes on the face yeah. and an awful lot of the products that go on the body are 100% from a plant or a fruit or a seed. So there's nothing in there that isn't from something living and growing. Okay. Now that means we're a vegan company. We don't test on animals either. We don't test any ingredients on animals. And as most people love animals, that's always an yeah, important thing. Definitely. There are certain companies out there that say they don't test on animals. And then in small print it will say, unless the country that we're selling in insists on it. And I can tell you now, some of those companies you would not believe. Wow. Um, they're major companies that are worldwide. If, they, if you sell a product in China, then it's going to be tested on animals because they won't allow people yeah. to, um, to have those products unless they're tested. At Tropic, we use us, ourselves. I've actually just finished a trial for several new products that are coming out soon and I was okay. given samples and then I had to feed back what they felt like, okay. smelt like, whether they worked, you know, how my skin felt afterwards. So we use human beings to test the products. Okay. So does anybody have any questions for Jenny before we continue? Um, just drop a question down in the little comments box and we will answer them. So we are 100% naturally derived, and the reason we've done that, we can say that, and Susie's pretty sure that we are actually unique on that in the world, is that she's invented a way of preserving the products, because every product, whether it's you know, a, a pot of cream or a liquid, needs to, um, needs to have something to stop it going off. Um, so that's where parabens come in, and other ingredients that sort of preserve. 
So we don't actually use uh, parabens, as I said before. Um, we use a mixture of basil, maize, and um, star anise, which is a little Chinese spice, zinca, five spice. It smells of aniseed, and that, that sterilizes the product and keeps it fresh. We are the only company that put a best before date, you see on, uh, best before date on the bottom of each of our products. And um, on the tubes, it's to be found on the top there. Uh, so the tubes will have the best before date. It's a bit like food, you know when you buy yeah. food, you, it doesn't go off on that date, but it yeah. doesn't taste maybe as, quite as, so nice. Yes, well, our products will still work, they'll still be effective, they won't suddenly get toxic but they might not smell as fresh as yeah. they did. Because we perfume our products with, our, with this, uh, essential oils. So if it smells wonderful, like that's not lovely, didn't it? So it's not perfumed No perfume. Oil. It's only got the essential oils that it comes with, that's in the ingredients. I was lucky enough to go up with um, one of our guests here tonight, Michelle, and I went up to HQ a couple of weeks ago, and Susie Ma let us make um, body creams and shower gels and shower scrubs uh, and she helped us make the recipes up and she actually came round to my table and I was whisking um, mango butter and shea butter together wow. with a bit of coconut and she actually said oh, that smells wonderful and I put in a couple of bits of essential oil and, she, and then I ate it. Oh really? <laughs> I had a little taste and she said yeah, you're eating it. I said well there's nothing in there that, that is not food at yeah, the moment. Definitely. If I put the sparkle in it might be yeah, a bit not yeah, yeah. good. But uh, it was absolutely edible. It tasted lovely, actually. Amazing. It really tasted good. So these products are good enough to eat. So have we got any questions? No, no questions no, no. yet? Okay, if you want to ask any questions, just, just let us know. Should we tell them about so, some of the products? Yeah, that's definitely. Mm. I think one of the first products that we need to teach them about is our skincare mm. kit. Yeah. So I'll just reach over and... Okay, they're over there. Up until they? quite recently, this was Susie Ma's favourite product. And it's one of the first things she made, one of the four things that she went on The Apprentice and she was making this then as a, as a young lady. Um, and she used to make it in the kitchen in a saucepan. And I've seen the saucepan, it's, only, wow. it's quite small. Um, and they pack it and send it out to the customers. So when you buy a cleanser from Tropic Skincare, it's never less than, well, it's never more than a month old because they make it fresh every day. So some days there will be, um, they'll be making cleanser, and then yeah. the next day they might make a body screw, scrub, and yeah. the next day they might make something to make you go brown, you know, yeah. fake tan or something. So it depends on what the orders are coming in, they'll work out what they need to make. Amazing. So our cleanser, uh, it smells amazing, I wish it was smelly vision, because you've got three gorgeous essential oils in there. It's eucalyptus, rosemary, and lemongrass, and then most of the rest of the ingredients are sweet, or, sweet almond oil, and it's got things, beautiful other ingredients in there that will make your skin feel really soft when yeah, you use it. Yeah, it does. It sure. comes with a little, um, have you got one of those bamboo cloths open? If you haven't, <laughs> we'll open this one. Okay. Have, you got, have you got a pair of scissors? Because you need to cut it. So it comes with a bamboo cloth. The bamboo cloths that we use are 100% organic and they are from a sustainable plantation. It grows 34 inches a day. Wow. So it grows really quickly, and then it make they make it into a, a like it looks like a flannel, but it's actually a, a sort of cleansing wipe. So it looks like feel how soft. It's I so think. soft, honestly. It's like a microfiber fleece, and it's not bleached. Its natural colour is this sort of creamy green colour. So this is an antibacterial cloth. It'll stay antibacterial for four months, and it comes free with the cleanser. You can buy them as well for a fiver, but it comes free with that. Every time you buy a cleanser, you get one of those. So how you use this product? You put about three pumps on the back of your hand, rub it all over your face. Men can use this as well. Um, if you're wearing eye makeup, which I do, it, <laughs> it takes all. It doesn't Definitely. sting. It doesn't sting. No. So you rub it all over your face, and then you put your cloth in some hot water, yeah. not boiling hot, but you know hot enough to make it feel nice. And then scrunch it. You don't wring it because it breaks the fibres. Yeah. Scrunch it, and then literally you lay it over your face and wash, you know, let the heat of the yeah, water, open the pores, opens the, pores the, clean, the cleanser goes in and then you use it almost like a face wipe, you yeah. wipe it all off, it's completely um, gentle and you can use it on babies and children, yeah, rinse it out, put it on the side of the bath, it dries overnight and it stays fresh, yeah. um, now you do have to wash it, um, but probably not on, more than about 30 degrees, yeah. Yeah, um, yeah. so this is probably one of my favourite products, I can't live without it, it it's is lovely. just amazing. So that's our cleanser. I mean, my daughter, she's 19, and she uses, a, she did use a lot of the makeup wipes that you get that yeah. are really well, not good so for you. I, I've done that as well myself. Let's face it, I'm 63 next Monday. 
<laughs> I am 63 next Monday, which is why I've been nursing so long. Wow. Um, but I've been using these products for now two and a half years and my skin has gone back in time. I used to use a mixture of all sorts. I might have a, a boots cleanser, a Clinique toner and yeah. a, you know, something else, Avon um, moisturiser. I'd have anything that was cheap and, and yeah. that was on the sale. Sort of. On yeah. sale. Because that's, a you know, I didn't yeah. earn a lot of money and that's yeah. what I used to use. But since I've been using Tropic, I've noticed a massive change in my skin. My pores have got smaller, um, it's got more moisturised, it's not dry anymore, it used to be really dry. I, I had wrinkles coming, they've gone. Um, and I, people tell me I don't look my age. Yeah, you don't. She really doesn't, everybody. All the time, so that's <laughs> nice. And at the moment, I've got no makeup on apart from my makeup and a bit of lip gloss. So Amazing. it's just, you know, it does make your skin look good. So the cleanser is our sort of staple um, starter for 10. And then we have this gorgeous toner. Now it's quite warm today, I love isn't it? The toner. The toner is addictive, I warn you girls <laughs> and boys. Um, so this is really handy to keep in the fridge on a hot day yes. and just spritz your face whenever you feel cold. I'm just going to show you. Go on then. Close your eyes. I'm going to go one, two, three. One, two, three. How does that feel? It smells amazing. <laughs> and it, it, feels it smells soft. like <laughs> cucumber and rose. Oh, it's lovely. It smells so fresh and lovely. There's no alcohol in there, Liz, because yeah. it doesn't. they don't need that to preserve it. And alcohol's very drying, so it doesn't have alcohol in it. Um, that means any of our clients can use it, any, any customers of any religious persuasion, if they yeah. don't want to use an alcohol-based um, product. It's full of vitamins. So those vitamins are in, uh, in there, and it goes through your skin. They actually go right into the skin. It's also got aloe vera. In fact, 70% of that is organic aloe vera juice. Um, which is they don't really use water in, in our products they use aloe vera juice and chamomile and rose waters and things like that so a lot of that it's got olive in it and okay. it's got um, something from a willow tree which calms the skin down if you've got a red sore face if you've got rosacea or acne or you've, you've got eczema or any of those things I've never seen so many cases of people with skin conditions as we have because of all the chemicals we use yes so this right. toner is going to close your pores down it's going to bring the ph the acid acid levels of your skin back to what they should be which is slightly acidic so it's ph balance the whole range is ph balance and it smells amazing i actually used that my husband is a builder and he came in the other day with my son because he'd been working with him and they both got sunburn oh it's fantastic sunburn. and the first thing i did was stop and I sprayed them and they felt a lot better. Does well, that's the aloe vera. Yes. And it's also got the willow, which calms redness down. So yep. if you've got re a rosy face, uh, rosacea, acne, yep. rosacea or rosacea, it makes your face look calmer and cooler. And you can use it as many times in the day on top of your makeup. Um, or under it. You don't need to put it on a pad and wipe it over, you just literally spray, spritz it. The, the droplets are so fine that they go through the skin instantly and hydrate you. So we do a little travel set actually, which we haven't got on the table, but it's a little bag of, um, of mini versions of this. Um, and you get a mini one of that, which if you're going on a plane and you want to take oh, um, hand luggage only, this is it here. Thank you, Steph. So this little kit here is one of our top sellers at the moment, of course everyone's on holiday. You get the bamboo cloth, you get the tube of cleanser, and there's loads in there. And that's certainly enough for a month. Yeah, definitely. Uh, then you've got the lovely dinky little toner, but plenty enough for your holiday and beyond. Then you have our day cream, which we'll talk about in a second. Um, we have a bottle of our magic elixir. Okay. And the lip love, which is just amazing yeah. lip balm. So that little uh, kit That's there. a great trial kit or travel kit, whatever you want to call yeah. it. That is yeah, that's one wonderful. Two, um, Absolutely. So the, the uh, other thing we have um, in that little trio to go with the cleanser and then the toner, the third part of it is the um, skin revive. This is the amazing day. I thing. love this one. It's like a fruit salad. I love them all, actually. <laughs> um, I do warn you, these products are quite, quite addictive. They are. <laughs> so this one, if I put some on your hand, see if you can smell what's in there. So it has a smell. It's very, it's very, very quickly absorbed, so you don't have to rub it in for ages. It goes in very quickly. Um, and it's got a magic ingredient in there. How much is the travel kit? The travel yeah, kit is, is 30. um, 38, 28 for the one I've just shown you, but there is another um, addition, which we'll talk about in a second, which has a mini tamanu balm in it this is normally 16 pounds um, and this will make the travel kit then 38 pounds but you get this for six pounds off the price it's only 10 pounds yeah now this. you'll hear about tomorrow in a minute uh, about how amazing this is because this is actually my favorite product and i'll tell you why but going back to this gorgeous skin revive okay um it's got 20 different plants in it 
It smells amazing. It smells amazing. It does. It? Really it's got sort of rose geranium, chamomile. It's got all sorts of lovely berries and things. But the other thing it's got in it is hyaluronic acid. Okay. Hyaluronic acid is a skin plumper that um, it makes your skin hydrated. It actually draws water in from the atmosphere. So if you have a little bit of hyaluronic acid on your skin, um, it will absorb a thousand times its own weight. Wow. But it's a natural product. We make it in our skin. So okay. babies have got loads of it. Old people haven't. Okay. Which is why the skin gets drier as you get older. So this is, um, the hyaluronic acid in there is wonderful, but there's also a plum extract, yeah. which makes it very good for antioxidant um, benefits. So this is for everyone. I use it in the morning, and then I use a night cream at night. So I have to say I use it twice a day. You use it twice a day. I'm younger than me. <laughs> Not much, but yeah, a little bit. <laughs> um, so you can use it morning and night, um, but Four you do weeks. the cleanser, the toner and that. It's called the ABC. ABC, and I have to say, I, I never used to, before I was Tropic, they asked me, what what kit do you use? Is that water? Yes. Um, I, I used to but use But once I started soap. using it, I have to say, your skin feels so amazing yeah. that you actually do get hooked, because you want to, the smell for a start is... is Mine. And it's so quick to use. And it's so quick to it's use. So quick. And actually, the okay. difference in my skin mm -hmm. in the last month of using these products. Yeah. Well, yeah. I can see a difference since Ma I last saw you. So much. Yeah, yeah. it's amazing. Um, so this this little trio here is what we call our ABC. It's like our basic starter kit. And you get the choice of two free things. Yes. I'll tell you about the first one. So we we are covered. I don't know if you know about anatomy, um, Liz, but we we grow skin right from the bottom layer, right deep at, down at the bottom of our skin. It's called the germinal layer, and we grow skin cells, and they come to the surface. And it takes a young baby doesn't take very long at all. But when when you're a bit sort of older, it takes about 28 to 30 days to grow a new face. Okay. That means from the bottom skin to the surface. The surface layer is dead, and some some people never ever get rid of that that dirty sort of um, ashy um, skin cells but if you do you're going to find that your skin looks fresher and younger so you need to get rid of it it's a bit like when you've got a dirty pair of boots and they're covered in mud yeah you wouldn't put polish on top of the mud would you no so what what if you did it wouldn't work the polish wouldn't go into the leather you need to, it's yeah. a, you need to get rid of the rid mud of first so if you think of the dead skin as a sort of layer of mud and dirt you need to grate it off and get rid of okay. it okay now there are lots of things out there there's a great deal of publicity at the moment about things called microbeads okay, yeah uh, microbeads are basically killing our ocean they're filling our ocean with tiny little plastic beads that are getting into the ecosystem fish are eating them they're getting into the food chain and there are actually some countries now that don't have tuna in their sushi because the tuna is toxic because yeah. the toxins go into the beads from the okay. sea and then, and then they get eaten. We don't use microbeads. We don't use anything. We use exfoliating in anything. We use salt in the body scrub. Um, in the um, lips, we use sugar. Yeah. And we use rice and bamboo in this one. Okay. So rice, ground rice is very exfoliating, but very, very gentle. Um, the juice from bamboo, when it's crystallised, goes like little glass beads, but they're round. Okay. And they dissolve in water. So what you do is, you again, on dry skin like, like this one, you um, rub it on your skin, not in your eye area, you rub it on your skin and then you uh, rinse it away with warm water and then you don't need to do anything. So twice a week, this is a yeah. night off from doing anything else. If you've got eye makeup on, you need to take that off first. Yeah. This will give you the most gorgeous, um, clean face. Then you go to bed and wake up in the morning and you cannot stop touching your skin because it feels so smooth. So this one has got um, oils of orange, lemon and lime, so it smells like yes, it smells good enough to eat. Really a little nice. bit of salt in there, um, and the base is, is sweet almond oil again. Okay. So it's lovely. So this is normally £15. You get it free, free. when you buy <laughs> we like free. the ABC. <laughs> the other thing you could have as your free gift is um, something else that's really handy oh, to have. Oh, I love yeah. this. <laughs> so why do you love it? I love it because... Well, recently I haven't been sleeping well and I get really tired eyes and dry eyes and so either in the afternoon when you, you just feel, your eyes feel heavy and you just feel tired and they itch and I go to the fridge because I keep mine in, yeah, in the fridge and um, it just cools and soothes my eye. It actually helps with hay fever as Smell well. It. I love it. it. Smells like salad. Um, <laughs> it, I actually went out because my father was in the hospital not long ago, and I would keep it in my bag and um, just keep awake and just yeah. Just, it's it's yeah. called eye refresh, and it's a very it really yeah. does its job. 
So why this is so good, it's actually one of Lord Sugar's favourites, because he works in computers. Yeah. And he's an old gentleman, he's old in his early 70s now. Yes, he is. He um, has, um, he gets tired eyes. So they, he literally goes like this around his eyes a few yeah, times yeah. a day, he's got it near his computer. But what this uh, contains is aloe vera gel, and it has also got other things like um, honeysuckle, a little bit of arnica, which is really yeah. good homeopathic remedy for taking away dark circles and bruises. So it's got that in. It's got cucumber in it. You can smell it, can't you? Yes, really strong. Definitely. So the cucumber is, you put it, you know, instead of having a slice of, of that on your eye, this is equivalent to that. It's also got um, ginseng, and it's got green coffee and white tea. So those things stimulate the eye. They're really, really good. I have noticed, because before I, I started using the product, I had really dark circles. And since using that product, yeah. it has really helped me. One of my little patients, because I'm a children's nurse, one of my patient's sisters has got terrible hay fever. Oh. And a couple of weeks ago, I had this in my in my handbag, which I always do. Um, and she you know you had swoll right? swollen... Yeah, they just um, can't hear you properly. Oh, no, right. it says people are whispering. I think oh, right, okay. <laughs> Sorry, we're not whispering, we're talking. <laughs> um, but you can reply on we are. Yeah. Yeah. So we are. this product um, is really good for people with hay fever okay. because it sort of hydrates the eye and it goes into the eye and seems to just moisturise it and it doesn't sting um, and it does reduce swelling as well. So yeah. It's calm the eye. It is really good. I love and it. And the little uh, ball is very cold. It's it is. Still. Yeah. So it massages. So the best way to do it is to from the outside in and then it'll massage the fluid around the eye into the a uh, little duct in the corner, it'll come out and, and it'll make your eyes less puffy. Now, if you wake up in the morning with puffy eyes, that is a fabulous thing to use. Um, so that one there is another free gift. So you, you get a choice yes. out of those two. You can choose the face smooth or the... Um, if you buy an ABC yeah. kit that you're going to use daily. And that's £52. And now, if you think of it, when you think how long it's going to last you, this lasts me about 10 months and it's free. Yeah. That lasts me about 10 months and it's free, so it's, that doesn't count. The cleanser lasts me four months, and it, so that's a pound a week, and I use it 14 times every morning and yeah. every night. The toner lasts me about seven or eight months, um, so it's less than a 50p a week to use that, much less. The Skin Revive, again, lasts me about four months, uh, because I use a night cream at night, so again, it's, it's such a cheap thing to use over the course of that time. So it's per use spend is very, very low. Oh. And you, you don't get freebies very often either with other things, but you do with us. They're saying not great. Um, have the phone on full and it sounds like they're far from the mic. Do you want me to put it a bit oh, closer? Oh, right, okay. Okay, let's move yep. it closer. Yes. Is that better? Oh, that's true. Is that yeah. better? Hopefully it is. Is that better? F thumbs up, anybody? I don't think you can see any louder. Let me bring it a bit closer. Yeah, we'll just bring that up right closer there. Yeah. Trevor yeah. Said, oh, yeah. great. Perfect. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Lots Sandra. of thumbs up. Lots of thumbs up. Thank Yay. you. Yeah. <laughs> right, going back to that little travel kit that okay. we showed you earlier. We mentioned a product called Tamanu Balm. Yes. Now, this is one of the reasons I love Tropic so much, because I had a really bad accident on my leg almost as soon as I joined Tropic. And I gashed it open on a piece of um, a piece of wood with which was a bit rotten, oh. and I got um, a gash about that long in my shin, and it was right down to the muscle. Um, so one of my friends, a girl called Jill, who's actually one of my tropic ambassadors above me, she gave me a pot of tamanu balm, and she said, as soon as you can get into the wound, start putting it on. Fortunately, a couple of weeks later, I met Susie Ma, and that was one of the first things she said to me was. How's your leg? And I thought, how the hell do you know my leg's cut? But Jill had said, <laughs> yeah. I've given this to her. And she said, can you take photographs of your leg as it goes through the healing process? Which is what I did. My leg has no scar on it. And it didn't get infected. And it, didn't, it wasn't sore. And there's not even a lump under the shoe. That's amazing. So what this product contains is a green oil called tamanu, tamanu oil. And it's called the tree of, no, it's not the tree of life. It's one of the most common um, use, used products in Polynesia. They've used it for centuries as a healing oil. Okay. And it rejuvenates and, and regenerates skin cells. So it's so good for so many things. I've actually done a long list of things. So if anyone buys this, we'll send, we'll put that out and let everyone have it. Um, it's really good for chicken pox. Oh, really? It's good for um, scars of any sort, old or new. It's great if you're pregnant and you don't want to get stretch marks. It's really good for that. It's actually won an award from Mother and Baby. Oh, uh, wow. Mother and Baby. Um, it's got blackcurrant seed and raspberry seed in it, as well as tamanu. It's got coconut oil in it, coconut butter, 
and it, it melts when you put it on your skin. So there's a whole list, actually, thank you. There's a whole list here that I've done, and the company actually uses this now. Um, it's good for stretch marks, it's great for nappy rash. I use it on my patient's bottoms. Um, it's great for psoriasis as well, okay. really good for that. It stops it itching and getting uh, dry, and it helps actually remove, remove it. It's really good if you've got rosacea, it helps that redness, and it, and it sort of diminishes any scarring as well from the acne. Um, it's good for breastfeeding mummies. It's a gentle, natural product, remember, and it's really good for, the, for when you're breastfeeding and your nipples get sore. Sorry, yeah. too much information then. <laughs> Sorry about that. I am a nurse. <laughs> or if you're jogging or going on a marathon, you get jogger's nipple. Oh, really? <laughs> well, apparently I yeah. don't, because I've never done it, but you do. That would be good for that. Some people put Vaseline on. Yeah. Vaseline is about the most toxic thing. You check it out on things. I would have never thought that Vaseline before. comes from petrol, so it's it's from oil, and they yeah. boil it, and then the Vaseline is the jelly that forms at the top of the distillation tube, and then they scrape it all off, full of toxins, put it in a jar, and we put it on our lips and our baby's That's bottom. mad. It's mad. Why are we it? doing that? <laughs> and it's really good if you've got a sting or a bite, so mozzie bites or a burn or, or a bee sting. Um, yeah, we've got some really good pictures here, actually. This is a lady. This is, uh, this is um, Tamanu and the ABC on a lady with very bad acne. So this was her at the start. I remember this story. And this is her some while later. Now, how long did it take for that? What does it say um, there? Not very long. the pictures. So the 9th of Feb to Ninth. the 20th. So from the 9th of February to the 20th of February, her back went from that and that. And that's because her sister is an ambassador. Um, and she actually said, let me use your back as a tester for the ABC, which you've just seen, the cleanser, the toner, and the moisturiser, and then the um, skip the tomato balm. That's amazing. And that's what the result was. So that girl went to her prom with a, a completely clear back, and it's just amazing for that. Um, as a nurse, there's a lot, of, an awful lot of eczema around, because so many My chemicals. My daughter's got eczema at the moment. I used to have it. That. My son gets it on his eyes. This is uh, Tamanu on someone with, actually this is psoriasis, not eczema, I recognise it. So psoriasis gives you this sort of thick, um, overgrown area, and this is Tamanu. I don't know what the time frame is, because it's not written on there, but you can see the effect of how that is used there. And much, much better, and I bet that's completely gone. Yeah. So we don't make medical claims, we're not really supposed to, but as a nurse, I'd say that yeah. it's going to help you with these things. Um, radiation burns. Now, people with, um, who are going radiation art for cancer treatment, there's very little you can put on your skin. Yes, my sister's got, mm, she can't use anything. You're not allowed to do, really, wash it even, or put any creams and things. No. Now, it also burns the skin. And uh, so this tamale balm is about the best thing you can put on a radiation burn. And in fact, quite a few hospitals are actually beginning to look at tamale. Wow. Um, as, okay. uh, not necessarily our tamale balm, but tamale as an ingredient. Yeah. Um, so this is Tamanu and Elixir oil on someone with, um, this is eczema, and again, some of the before and after pictures, and these aren't us, this is people that ring, ring up and say, we've got an amazing result here, can I send you some photographs, and we obviously yeah, take fantastic. them. Someone's just joined the group and asking what product are you talking about? This is Tamanu Balm, um, whoever this lovely person is, this is the Elizabeth. mini version, Elizabeth, this is Tamanu Balm. Sixteen pounds, yep. um, or ten pounds if you buy it as part of the travel kit, handbag size, and it's got twenty mils in it. So that will last you ages. Size as you well. do. This is one I'd say. This is the home one that stays in the bathroom cabinet. And you're, if you've got children, this is the magic cream for things like grazes, cuts and burns, and you know any stings or what have you. A go-to thing the, for a mum. It does. It and actually it works has chicken pox. Oh, it's fantastic on chicken pox. It really is because it's antiviral, it's antifungal, it's antibacterial. In fact, it's the same killing bug ability as amoxicillin, but wow. it's, not, it's got no antibiotics in it, it's completely natural. Um, it's also really good at, for analgesia as well. So if you've got a cut or a, a graze, it takes the pain away. Yeah. My leg did not hurt at all. That's amazing. Um, so this size is three times bigger, this is 60 mils, as opposed to the little 20 mil one. Uh, so this one can stay at home, it'll last you a good year or two, this one. Uh, January, January, June 18, so it's a good year old, and you'll use it in that time frame because yeah. it goes on so many things. And this mini one is great for holidays and handbags. So one of my favourite things, and I'm very, very passionate about it. Um, it's really good on lips, lip balm. It's good if you've been ta had a tattoo and you want to make sure it doesn't get infected. Okay. If you if you've been waxed or plucked, you get red sore. Yeah. It's really good for that. It's really good for cold sores because it's antiviral. In fact, if you've got a cold sore coming, it's about the best thing. Cracked heels, cracked skin on your hands. 
Oh, so builders and decorators love it. Gardeners love it because it okay. just heals. All round favourite. That does, does definitely sound magical. It is. Do you agree? It Anyone? is. What else would you like? So now we're at the time of year where everybody needs suntan cream because oh. they're all going on their holidays. Yeah. And as I've been looking myself. I've got the Think Dirty app and all the products that I always use, my go-to products when I was going on holiday, all came out red. Yeah. So um, we have some amazing um, well, suntan creams. We do. We've got an after sun, which mozzies hate. Oh, really? I don't know if you realise that. No. Um, it's got a little bit of menthol in there. Okay. It's got three times the strength of aloe vera. They've actually distilled it, so it's three times the, wow. three times the strength of aloe vera, which is really good for sunburn. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but it, mozzies don't like menthol. So if you smell it, it smells... It does actually smell a bit like... Um, it's a lo oh. lovely and fresh smell, just to remind myself. Oh, that is... It's got a bit of a rosemary in it as well, I think. It's, it's really, gorgeous, it's really like you but it calms your skin down, it soothes it down, and it's got the, the magic ingredient is something called bisabalol, which okay. is Susie's favourite name. <laughs> bisabalol is an extract of chamomile which calms it down, so it's got aloe vera, triple strength, bisabalol and menthol. That's really smells nice. smells amazing. That's only £18. It's going to last you ages. A long time. Just, yeah, but really, and it, my hands feel cold now, the yeah. menthol's cooled yeah, it yeah, down. Yeah. Um, but the sunscreen, I'm passionate about the sunscreen because I loved going on holiday, but I burn. Um, and I used to use exactly what you did, anything that was cheap and cheerful, P20, yeah. you know, Avon, Sultan, whatever, anything that, like that. Um, and you're right, they contain something that uh, is toxic, and it's called oxybenzone, and it might be a slightly different name, but oxybenzone, the most common sunscreen, and it's really effective. It's so effective that if you've got a sunscreen that costs five pounds, mm -hmm. you'll still make it. They'll make a profit on it. So when you go into Boots and Asda and, and places like that, and they've got really cheap sunscreen, it will stop you burning. Yeah. But it won't be good for your skin, and it's certainly not good for the environment. So how it works? Uh, nor normal sunscreen. Uh, it, it, you have to put it on about fifteen minutes before you yeah. burn the sun, and then the uh, the chemical binds to your skin. And it actually turns the sunscreen into heat. It turns the sun's rays into heat. Okay. So it can actually start causing DNA changes, which is why the rates of skin cancer and melanoma have gone up so yep. much in the last 40 years, since people have been going on package holidays. Our skin, most English people are not, they haven't got a lot of melanin in the skin, which is what you need to protect it from the burning, the UVA, yeah. the UVB rays. Um, so our products are broad spectrum, which means they protect against... UVA and UVB. UVA is aging, UVB is burning. Okay. Um, so they're in the right proportion and they don't contain oxybenzone, they contain a mineral and it's the most effective sunscreen on the planet and wow. it's called zinc oxide. So is and that more expensive than the other one then? It's <laughs> about, yeah, it is a lot more expensive. So that's why you have to pay a bit more for a premium sunscreen. Yeah. But mineral sunscreen, if you actually Google it, it's right in the news at the moment. There are others out there, but this is a British brand made fresh every day. Uh, not this particular product every day, but yeah. within a 30-day turnaround from making it. It's got a lovely coconut, but very subtle coconut smell. Um, but it's got the best sun protection you've ever used. It's very water resistant as well. So these come up at £28. Okay. Now, they go on and on and on, because we've just come back from Portugal, my husband and I, we use them, and we've still got loads left. So it will still be usable next yeah. year, ne like another holiday. If it went on the sunbed next to me in the blazing sunshine, it won't degrade. The, c the contents will still be fresh and okay. absolutely safe to use. Um, so zinc oxide, it's safe enough to put on a baby's bum. It's actually in most sun uh, bottom creams for, for nappy rash. And um, we have very uh, large particles. They're not nano-sized particles. So um, the nano-sized particles in a lot of other sunscreens um, actually go into the skin, yep. and ours don't. They, they sit on and form like a barrier, like, yep. a, like a, an armour, an armour okay. plating for the skin. So we've got SPF 15, 30, and 50. That's for the whole family. Yeah, um, I would say babies need 50, Definitely. children need 50. Uh, as the holiday goes on, 30 is fine. 15 is really for, in the winter you should be using 15. Really? Yeah. So we have um, a really good sun balm here, which is um, a very, very high SPF. It's SPF 50, it's actually tested far higher than that in the testing. Um, and it's, this is really good for babies. It's also got tamano in it. That has it. Which you can smell, a bit of tamano. Yeah. And rosemary in there. So this is really good for those places that burn. So on yeah. me, that would be my nose, the tops of my cheeks, uh, my lips, 
my there on my chest, my yeah. tops. Of, I always get burnt here, and my knees. <laughs> um, <laughs> yeah, it's it, really good for skiers because they get very red faces, the yeah. bits that are sticking out, and they're right at the top. Of, there's no ozone up there, and it, they get much yeah. more burnt when the rays come through. Um, so that's a really good product, and it's slightly cheaper. That's twenty four, but it's sixteen. 16. Is it only sixteen? Wow. Well, okay. Bargain. Bargain. This one here is for um, ladies because it's got a tint to it. So we've got medium dark, medium dark, and then light medium, and it's the same SPF as the sunscreen, but no fragrance, no coconut, and it's got um, a really good product in there called hibiscus, which is we call it Botox. <laughs> and it's for your face. It's isn't for it? your face. So this one is a really good one. It tightens the skin and really helps you get a lovely tan without burning. Lovely. Um, it's got that colour in it to. So you look healthy yes. on the beach, you don't yeah. have to, but you can use that every day in the summer, it's just a lovely product. Instead of your moisturiser that's tinted, you could use yeah. that because of the SPF in oh, it. Oh, that's awesome. We've got, we've got SPF in another product we have, um, which we can't see on the table, but it's a beauty boosting cream, and I can't live without it. I really can't. It's got SPF 35. So that's like the foundation. It looks like a tinted foundation. It comes in six different colours that match our mineral makeup. Um, but the BB cream has got SPF 35, so wow. it's perfect for daytime use yeah. um, on an everyday occurrence. Just but when you're the car to yeah, on, on holiday, um, you need something that's waterproof if you're going in the sea or yeah. you're swimming. So that's when you'd actually use this. Yes, um, so this is a water resistant product, and our beauty. Thank you, Michelle. This is our beauty boost. Um, it, it's fantastic. It's 22 pounds, but it lasts for ages. It lasts me about. Probably about a year. Really? Yes, because okay. you don't need very much of it. And I put it on with my fingers, but some people use a sponge or a brush. Um, and it's got all sorts of wonderful things in there, including the hyaluronic acid okay. that pumps your skin and hydrates it. It's got something called resveratrol, which is from grape skin, grape seed skin, grapes, grape, red yep, grapes. Yep. Um, it's very antioxidant and it's got um, SPF 35 because it's got titanium and zinc oxide, titanium dioxide and zinc oxide in it. Um, but it's got tinted to match your skin, so we can colour match you. The other thing we didn't say, which is really important, at the beginning, if you ever invest in a product that's tropic and it's not the right colour or the right product for you, we have a 30 day money back yeah. guarantee. So 30 day, 30 day money back guarantee, no quibble, you just get your money back and uh, it's free to return it as well. So you get a free label back. But we get so few things back, to be honest, that it doesn't really happen very often. So what about products for people that can't go in the sun, like um, some can cancer patients can't go in the sun? Right, so you want Do something? we have anything that we could use that's natural and we give them an instant tan? Absolutely. And we've got, we've got two products actually. The reason I haven't got any makeup on my face is that I use something called Sun Drops, which is one of my favourite makeup products. It's actually, a, it's actually a sort of fake time for your face. It's not okay. heavier makeup, is it? It's more like a skincare product. 100% naturally derived. The colour, it looks like, um, like caramel, that sort of coffee colour. And that's because it's got caramel in it. It's colour coded so that you know when you where you've put it. Okay. So what you do with this one, you get a bit of your moisturiser, your day moisturiser, put a couple of drops of that in and mix it on your hand, and then put it on your face. It's actually just won an award. Uh, there we are. Put it up to the screen. There you go. It's 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 um it's gonna last you ages. It's, it's I still use the one from last summer. Wow. This and okay. it's still going strong. It's got a little pipette, so it makes it easy to work out how so many drops you So you put that with your Revive? Could you, you do. You literally yeah. mix it on your hands, mix it up. Now, this has just won an award from Good Housekeeping. Okay. And they're really sticklers for are, yeah. using, um, for what they give awards to. And the feedback was so good, because whatever colour skin you've got, it'll give you the natural colour that you would normally go in the sun. Oh, that's good. So it doesn't tint your face orange. You don't look like an yeah. Oompa You look... Uh, you look lovely and golden, but not not unusually yeah. golden. So over the course of two or three days, you can use it, and you'll build up this lovely golden. Um, okay, so it doesn't tan. wash off once you get in the shower. No, it doesn't wash off. It wears off if you stopped using it over the course of another few days. Okay, it actually makes the top layer of skin change colour. Okay. It doesn't go right down. It's not it's not an SPF. You still okay. have to use SPF. Sure. But it gives you a lovely natural colour. And the great thing is, if you want only a little bit of golden colour, you just put two drops. If you want a bit more, you maybe put three or four in. So it's totally so up. How to much is that? Twenty-two pounds. Okay. And um, one of our top-selling products at the moment because of that award. So this is for your face. This is for your body. Okay. This smells like pina colada. Oh, <laughs> gorgeous smell. I wish oh, this yeah, was it does. <laughs> so this is our Tropic Summer Skin. 
and um, again, I saw this being made at the head office and it looks like coffee cream ice cream when it's really? coffee ice cream. Um, it looks like coffee ice cream when it's in, it comes out on your hand as well. It's a light brown. If I, I'll just put some on there, that sort of colour. So you can actually see where you've put it. Yeah. So what I do is I have a shower. I usually use body scrub the day before. So I've got all the oils back into my skin. And then I would have a shower, pat myself dry, and I would use this as a moisturiser. Okay. So I literally put it all over my body. Um, not my face, but you can do it on your face if you want to. It smells amazing. And if I didn't oh, wash my hand now, I'm going to just go and rinse it off. You've got a little bit of kitchen towel, I can just wipe it off. That would have a little light brown circle on it in the morning. So you do need to use either a mitt or use your hands and then wash it. Wash your hands off. So you wouldn't put it on at night because then when you get into bed, would it? I do. I actually, you can use it in the morning or night, depending on when you have your shower. Or okay, but it, it doesn't come off on your... It wouldn't, it wouldn't <laughs> stay in your... Bed sheets no, or anything. no. Once it's gone into the skin, it's a really lovely moisturiser. Okay. And um, it smells amazing. Now, oh, some fake tans smell of old biscuits. Oh yeah, no. Horrible I smell. Think they're horrible. This one doesn't. It really doesn't. It's got a bit of lime in there as well. But it, it smells like a pina colada. It's gorgeous. <laughs> um, now, this is a gradual tan. So over the course of maybe three or four days, you'd use that, and it would build up a lovely colour. Um, and go the colour that you would normally go. So if you have pale skin normally, you won't go really, really brown. It'll just give you a golden colour. So it's a gradual build up. You don't get streaks with it. because oh, that's good. Because you're using it every day and little bits are coming, you know, every day yeah. it's, getting, it's going further and further. It's just really making a very natural look. Don't put, um, when, you, when you do your feet, make sure you don't, uh, you wipe the bottom of your soles of your feet because the cream can not be brown. No, no. And <laughs> definitely your palms of your hands. Yes. <laughs> So I actually use a bit of the face smooth on my yeah. hand when I've done it and I, I rub my hands together like that and then get a flannel and wipe it off. That and sounds great. So how much is that? It's only £24. I'm Not still bad. using the one I bought last summer because okay. you don't use it every day. You no. use it in the summer. But because it lasts a good year and a half or so, yeah. you're absolutely fine. And it, and it won't go off even if it's past its sell-by date. It still work. And, and it so won't do any what harm. happens if you're going out for to, to a wedding at this time of year and you want to go and get a spray tan? But spray tans can't be good for you because of the chemicals. They're so not. have we got something else that we could use for instant? We have instant glow. <laughs> I love this product. So instant glow are these are this is for when you you suddenly realise your legs look like milk bottles <laughs> and you want some colour um, yeah. and you want to make them look nice. Now this has got something in there called with arnica. It's got arnica in there. So if you've got any bruises on your leg, it still helps you sort of calm them yeah. down and heal them. But the other thing it's got in is golden mica dust. So when I actually was there at head office, they were making this in a great big vat. And they, I asked him how many bottles, he said about 800 bottles wow. in that machine. And there was a big bowl of golden dust next to it. And I said, what's that? And he said, it's mica, which is mineral, it's a rock, ground okay. up, looks like gold dust. I stuck my finger in it and I had a gold finger. <laughs> it made me very happy. So I like to touch the little things. Yeah, the little things make me happy. Um, so instant glow. It does look a bit scary. You can put some on me. Can I? Yeah. Never squirt it straight on because if you've got cream carpet or anything like that, you can make a bit of a mess. I'm left-handed, so I'm going to just put some on my hand there. Now, can you see that, folks? Mm -hmm. It's like a sort of slightly darker than the other stuff. So you just be brave and put it on the arm and the hand or the legs, or the anything, any part of your body. And it's a cream. I've probably put way too much on, actually. So it goes on. It smells like the pina colada again. It's got a lovely smell. This has got coffee butter in it. I saw them making um, other products with coffee butter, and it does smell lovely. But it's also got this lovely, like, citrusy smell, it too. It is lovely. So this will take... Um, it, you, you don't, it doesn't streak because you've got time to sort of spread it until it sort of dries. It's a water-based product. Okay. There you go. So if you just put your arms like that together, you've actually got a bit of colour there. Oh, Can you see the difference in the... And you certainly see on my hand, it's sort of... Yes? Yeah. Like that. Now, you can do two layers. So you can let it dry. It takes a couple of minutes. Put a bit more on, and it really does look like you've just gone on the beach. It smells amazing. It smells fantastic, doesn't it? It's wonderful. So the other thing is, of course, you go into the shower at night, you have to scrub it off with your shower gel and it comes off. Um, but you can actually leave it on overnight. 
Um, so it's a really, really instant it fix is. if you're feeling a bit pale and wan. Great um, for proms and things. It's, oh, the teenagers love it. Yeah. Absolutely love it. It's £28, but again, it, it's going to last, last you for ages and ages because you're not going to use it probably in the winter. No. But if you need it in the summer, you can use it on your face. Actually, Susie uses it on her face. I it's have to use it on my face, I have to say. Yeah, so, so that's the instant fix. The okay. summer skin is the fake tan that, that stays. And probably if you stop using it, probably a week later you'd go back to your normal colour because okay. your, your skin would have shed the colour. So have we got anything else for um, a glow for when you're on holiday? Yeah, we have actually. Um, we've got this beautiful shimmering summer goddess body oil. Now I reckon this is it's going to be a limited edition. It's not going to be in the next catalogue. So if you want okay. this, get you have it. to get it now and then keep it for Christmas. There was someone put on the page the other day about that. It's, I think it's, it's actually the end of August. So yes, it'll be the end of August is when is when it probably will finish. Possibly, uh, you know, the early weeks of September. Uh, but it's a limited edition product, okay. so it's got this golden powder in it called mica that I put my finger in. It's got the most beautiful smell. It's got Tahitian bourbon in it, oh. uh, vanilla. So it's a really lovely smell, and it's a, an organic, hundred percent organic natural oil that you can put all over your body, and it makes you shimmer. It's particularly good if you're at a in a, a artificial lighting. Okay. So if you want to just try that, I don't know if it'll show. So you're on holiday and oh, you're going out for the evening absolutely. after you've been in the sun all day. When you've had your shower, this is the product to and use. You put your sun suit on, and then you just put a little bit of this lovely shimmery oh, oil. Feels on. amazing. Smell that. So a little bit of the shimmer, and under this light, you can see the light catching um, the little bits of mica. It's very flattering, but it that is. will go into the skin and just left, leave you with a lovely shimmer beautiful that smell amazing so that is a lovely product and we do have two highlighters for the face and okay. um, cheeks and as well one's called sun sun um, sunlight and one's called spotlight okay. the spotlight one is pinky colored the sunlight is a golden one so that's really nice for ch uh, highlighting your cheekbones your eye under here yeah. your eyelids uh, your tops of your shoulders your cleavage um, and in fact some girls put it on their lips because it makes your lips all shiny yeah. and golden so this is just. So there's some great products for I anybody think, that's going on holiday. Yeah. These great ones to buy and put away for a Christmas present for someone who likes it, sparkles yeah. because it's a really sparkly, gorgeous um, oil. So that's. And a lot of people go away at Christmas, so yes, it'd be nice to take. Absolutely, I'm really pleased I've got that in my in my kit because I will be using it for my Christmas parties and what have you. Yeah, so. so um, well, so that's that's an oil, isn't it? That's have we got any oil. other oils that we can use? We have actually. We've got two um, oils which a lot of people use uh, in massage. We've got a lot okay. of massage and beauty therapists who use these in their in their um, product range. This one is called Awaken the Senses, and it's a lighter colour than the other one, which is called Soothe the Senses. They both have a real flower in them. This has got a little real everlasting flower, and this one you've got, I don't know if you can see it, but it's got a a leaf, a magnolia yeah. leaf, a skeleton yeah. leaf in there. Um, so it's a beautiful gift as well. Um, it's 100% organic, essential oils. In that one, you've got things like neroli, you've got lime. It's a real citrusy burst. And it's a lighter oil. You can see that's a much richer one. Um, this one has got more argan oil in it. And it's got other oils, uh, things like uh, baruti oil. Can you put them in your hair? Absolutely. So if you've got dry hair, my hair does get dry in the summer. Just put some on your hands, go like that, run your fingers through, just twist it around the ends of the hair. Um, it, it makes your hair smell and look amazing. But the other thing you can use it for is, um, uh, is, is mix it with one of our other products. And that one is called Body Smooth, which is that lovely cream over there. So if you want to make your body, body love, which I'll tell you about in a second, even more gorgeous, especially if you've got dry skin, just jazz it up with a few drops of that. So our products, you can mix, and, mix them together and they're very complementary. Um, so this one is a real sort of sexy sensual one. Uh, it's really good for dry skin and dry hair. It's got things like frangipani and magnolia and absolutely gorgeous products like that. And it's it's really it's going to last you ages as well because the yeah. smell is so concentrated. It is, I, I love the smell. They are both lovely in their own right. They're twenty eight pounds. You can put them in the bath as well. Yeah. And you can mix them, um, you know, with with other oils to sort of loosen them if you want to do massages or just use them like that. Okay. We have got another one that um, we haven't spoken about. How could I forget the elixir? I'll tell you about the elixir. The, right, so that little kit we had at the beginning. Yes. There are other products that you can buy to supplement your um, skincare routine. This one is probably one of our best sellers. I use that at night. 
that I use this every night. It's called um, Elixir, Organic Elixir Oil. A little pipette there. It's going to last you ages. It lasts me more than a year. I can't open it because I've got oil on my fingers. Um, so it smells delicious. It's got a lovely smell of um, marzipan. Now, some people don't like the smell of marzipan. Oh, I yeah, I love it. Uh, but it's not actually it's almond. Not mar it's yeah. not. It's from a plum. It's from the middle of a plum stone. So what you do, you put a couple of drops in your hand and you just put your hands together and then just press it onto your face. Or you can put a bit more in, into your night cream or your day cream and massage it in like, like that. So this product has been in Susie's repertoire for 13 years. Wow. She started making it when she was 15 years old. Um, there are, there's an ingredient in there which is from the ancient Egyptian times. Oh, really? Uh, it's called Moringa and Moringa is called the tree of life. Okay. So the tree of life oil and it's mixed with other things like kiwi seed, pomegranate seed, and vitamin E, so there's no essential oils in this, so you can actually massage babies with it. Amazing. So elixir oil, up to 1,700 different antioxidants in it. Um, so it's really good, so it's an anti-aging anti oil. Anti-aging, I now, use it for anti-aging. I use it on my neck, yeah. I use it all over my face every night, just a couple of drops. The magic thing about this is you can get it free. <laughs> it's a really, really lovely ingredient, uh, product to get. If you pay for it, it's 26 pounds, but you can get it free in another collection that we do, two, two other collections. Um, so Elixir Oil, can't live without it. No, I love Absolutely it. Absolutely wonderful. Anti-aging. Going back to, just quickly, shall I talk yeah, about sure. the Body Love? This is, this is one of the four products that went to Lord Sugar's wife when Lord Sugar took the four products off and went to see what his wife thought of them. Oh, okay. Yeah, that was one of them, and that was one of the others. And she loved them. Absolutely loved them. So this is the, the best-selling moisturiser. It's called Body Love, and it's got uh, firming properties. So there's things like pink peppercorns and blue algae in there that's, that's supposed to help with cellulite. Yeah. You can massage it into the skin. It's easiest thing to put on really, really quickly after a shower or a bath. Smells amazing. It's got that lemony smell again that runs through the thing. So you can jazz up your um, oil with a bit of that. This has been magic for people with psoriasis and eczema. Okay. Um, and in fact, for um, babies, especially with eczema, this is really good for eczema as well. Um, because it's so gentle, it hasn't got any um, toxins or essential oils, you can put it on a baby. You can actually okay. massage babies with it. So you'd use both of those products for... Yeah, there's, there's quite a few things that help people with eczema and psoriasis. Certainly those two products are amongst them. Okay. And remember, you've got a 30-day trial with everything. So if it doesn't suit you, um, then you just give it, give it your money back. Okay. It's, it's, there's no quibble on it. Okay, right. There's one other product that I love the smell of, and it reminds me of sherbet. Oh. <laughs> I used this last night. I think the last time when I first met you, you made me lick my hand. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I did. It so apparently, lovely. this is one thing that it stuck with me. Jenny said if you if you wouldn't eat it, you don't, don't put, put it on, it on your skin. skin. <laughs> so that's what I tell all my ladies. Yeah. But do you want to tell us about that? But this is Good Skin Day. Um, it's forty-two pounds. It's one of our most expensive uh, products that we do. But it has got the most amazing effect on your skin and it's actually Susie's favourite product. It used to be yeah. the cleanser, it's now this one. So when you first buy this, uh, it's going to last you about 10 months. So again, if you break it down per use, it's actually not that much. No. Um, so I'd say it's about a pound a week to use it, probably twice. Okay. So you need three drops in the palm of your hand and so you literally just spray. Well, it's actually it's this little okay. pump like that. So it's a clear liquid. It's like a jelly feel to it, isn't it? Yeah. It smells amazing. It smells like pear. I think it smells like... <laughs> what do you think it smells Sherbet. like? Sherbet! It does, actually. <laughs> <laughs> it's, um, it smells... It's delicious. <laughs> it's actually got something in it called lime caviar, which is a little fruit that looks like a lime, but when you break it open, it's got tiny seeds in there full okay. of juice, and it's particularly good for the skin. It's also got lots of other fruits like papaya and pear, okay. mango and things like that. It's full of uh, lactic acid from, uh, not from milk, which is where it normally comes from, but from fruit. So this has got lots of gentle amino acids and fruit acids in it. So it's a bit like a chemical peel, but without the chemicals. Wow. So you put this on your skin at night and then you go to bed. You don't need to put anything on top of it. It's just one of those things you use maybe twice a, twice a week. Okay. Um, and then it will gently overnight dissolve the glue that sticks the dead skin to our, our skin. So okay. overnight, that lovely, gentle exfoliator, it's not an exfoliator, it actually dissolves the dead skin. So when you wash your face in the morning, all the dead skin goes down the, the drain. Amazing. And your skin feels baby soft. 
It's okay. absolutely fantastic. Now I always say use it three days in a row, the first, yeah. the first time you use it. The first day, put it on, leave it on 10 minutes, rinse it off. The next night, leave it on half an hour, rinse it off. The third night, uh, do it all night. And why is that? Well, because some people have got, they've got to build up the use. It's a bit like when you buy a new pair of shoes, you wouldn't put them on for the week, yeah. for the whole day. Okay. You'd break them in. And this product is different and it, some, it tings a little bit sometimes. Yeah. It tingles, it doesn't sting, but it tingles. People have got to get used to that, okay. but I, it doesn't do anything to me apart from yeah. make me skin, my skin feel lovely. Um, but it's such a gentle but effective way of making your skin look younger. It also helps stop blackheads oh, and right. open pores because it, it basically just dissolves all the stuff that gets stuck, stuck in, in, them. in the pores. So yeah. it's a really lovely product. So a good skin day. It's called a resurfacing serum. You can't better it. It's, no. it's wonderful. You pay a lot of money for a treatment you would, yes. with chemical, really nasty to chemicals in it yeah. that might burn your skin. Yeah, but try this. It's amazing. I mean, how many times have I watched chemical skin pills on TV? Yeah, yeah. So, so this is not chem. It's fruit. It's amazing. Really fruit. It's wonderful. It tastes nice. This <laughs> green bottle looks amazing. This super is, green. Yes. Yeah, what green. do we use this for? Well, super green. If you think of elixir oil, that lovely oil that we get, you get free in one of yeah. the sections, which we will talk about in a second. Um, that elixir oil um, is like having an omega three, omega six, omega nine okay. capsule. It's yeah. giving you the the lovely essential oils and, and, and vitamins that are fat, fat soluble. Yeah. So that's like an omega-3 boost. This one is a bit like having a vitamin shot. Okay. It's like having a smoothie every day with kale and broccoli. Yes, yeah, so it's a bit like a really healthy shot that you would drink. So instead of drinking it, you put it on your skin and it gives okay. your skin. So it looks this bright green colour is actually from plants, um, green plants. It's got chlorophyll in it. Okay. It's got, um, if I show you there, it's got spirulina, which is an yeah. algae. It's very superfood. It's got broccoli. It's got kale okay. and it's got tomato in it. That lovely extract. Okay, yeah. It's got a bit of tomato oil in there. And it's also got coffee in there, which gives it a bit of a kick. When you put coffee on your skin, yeah. caffeine wakes your skin up. So it's okay. got green coffee in there. And it's also got a lovely smell of passion. Is it passion fruit or pomegranate? I can't remember. It might be pomegranate. I think it's pomegranate. It smells like a cut grass lawn to me. <laughs> you know, that lovely okay. sort of fresh green. And is it only the face that you put it on? Well, you can put it anywhere on the body. It won't do any harm. It's particularly good for people with spots okay. and bad skin because a lot of the time they need the vitamins in there that come from, from eating greens and they don't do that. Yeah. I don't eat five a day. I wish I could, but I don't because I'm not, yeah. it just doesn't work, fit in with my, my life. But this is better than five a day. Okay. <laughs> it's got all of those wonderful Brilliant. vitamins going in. Um, now, I pick, I mix it with my day cream. So again, okay. like I use that at night with my night cream. To so use Skin Revive. I put a couple of drops yeah. of this in my day cream. Now, I do that every day. Okay. But apart from the days I'm using sun drops. And then yeah. I, because you shouldn't put an oil with water. And sun drops is a water-based product. Okay. This is an oil-based. So you use this on a day where you're just using it on the Skin Revive. Or any moisturiser that you happen to have. Again, £42 is going to last you probably about a pound, pound a week to use it. Not even maybe. that much, maybe lovely lovely product and one of our best sellers if you've got a, a teenager in the house or you have got skin that really breaks out easily Once probably the month, best thing you can use my daughter's always yeah if you've got acne scarring because a lot of people have got acne yeah. that's not there anymore but they're left with the scars yeah. because it's got the tamanu in and tamanu is really good at scar getting rid of scars it's going to help it's going to okay. really help that but it's going to help them because it's not although it's an oil it's a very light oil mm -hmm. so if they've got oily skin yeah. it's not going to so is this good for all our products? Everyone. They're good for all skin types. This one anyone can use for even sensitive okay. skin. In fact, I'd say probably it's about the most gentle range you can use out there. Okay. Because it's unique. There is nothing like us out there. So if it doesn't matter what skin type you have, you can use our products. Yes. There, there yeah. is only one skin, one cleanser, one toner, one moisturizer, one elixir, one night cream. Because Susie said, if you've got skin, then you can use our products. Uh, and, and it's true, the yeah. only people that can't use our products are those unfortunate people that might be allergic to a natural ingredient. Yeah. So okay. for example, my daughter is allergic to tamanu, so she oh. couldn't use, okay. in her pregnancy, couldn't use tamanu balm, but she used Body Love and Elixir Oil and hasn't okay. got a stretch mark on her. Wow. And then okay. the babies never had the toxins going in. While she was pregnant, Katie only used Tropic products, so my granddaughter has never had anything Can't bad on, on her going into the placenta. And that makes me feel great. Oh, definitely. Because I think you said, Michelle, that they're finding toxins in the umbilical cord blood. I think there's about 300, 400 chemicals that they find in the cord blood 
um, of, of shocking, isn't un, it? you know, babies that have just been born. Um, yes, two hundred. Uh, I can't 287 read that. Two hundred and eighty-seven toxic, toxic chemicals found in the cord blood of newborn babies, and it's, that was in Ch in, in America. Wasn't in America, it? Yeah. yes. Shocking, um, really. You know, you don't want to do that to your children, no. do you, really, if you no. don't have to? No, definitely not. Shall we show them about the money saving, how they get the elixir yeah, do for that. free? Yeah, yeah. Where's that lovely box? That lovely Here. Thing so we have two collections where you can get this free. We've already talked about all the products in there, apart from one. So this box here, you get the cloth. It's called the Super Deluxe Skincare Collection. So what you get in there is the cleanser with the bamboo cloth free well that you, that you get that free you get the toner the spritzy toner you get the lovely day cream that all those fruits yep. in it with the plum and it's and it's I've got the That's hyaluronic ABC. acid in the ABC you don't have to make a choice here between the eye refresh and the face mousse because it's both in there okay um, you also have a, the night cream now we haven't talked about that but we will do it's absolutely brilliant um, and then you get this eye cream which we haven't talked about we'll show you the other two anti-aging products you get a lovely headband as well so with this collection, what you're getting is the free bamboo cloth. You're getting a free elixir oil, which is worth £26. Which pounds. is this one? Yes, you're getting the lovely elixir oil. You're getting the um, eye cream, which I'll show you in a second, half price, it's only £10. And um, you've got everything there that we've talked about, and that's going to save you £41 or £42, depending wow. on whether you want the box. Okay. So you get the elixir oil free and you get the eye cream half price and a free headband. Amazing. This is called the Super Deluxe Collection and it's one of our top sellers. So people do realise that they're getting a lot of products for free. Now you, you would make that investment, you're going to not want to buy that too often. No. But um, you're going to be using the products at different rates so you will run out of cleanser, uh, maybe and the, the moisturiser of the day, yeah. skin cream, skin revive, maybe sooner than you will some of the others. So yes. as the products um, disappear, then you reorder them. So you, you really don't have to buy everything. That is £126 um, for the box. I think it's £125 without the box. Mm -hmm. So you've got a massive amount of products there. I used to spend over 80 on one cream. Because yeah. I thought spending a lot of money was a good thing, yeah. but it wasn't. It's not, it doesn't make any difference. So if you don't want the anti-aging eye cream, and you don't want the um, anti-aging night cream, which are wonderful, what you're left with is called the Deluxe Collection. You still get this beautiful oil for free, um, and you get a free headband, so it actually yeah. saves you um, £31. So it's a really, really good collection because you've got everything else that we talked about. And then, of course, when, if you don't want those anti-aging products, if you don't want the elixir oil, and you want to make a choice between the um, eye revive and the face smooth, then that's what you have in the ABC, but you don't get the, the headband and you either. you still get a bamboo cloth. You still get your bamboo cloth. You get the cleanser bamboo cloth, the toner, um, uh, the day cream, the skin revive, and then you choose the eye refresh or that. That's £52. It doesn't come in a box. I'd say that is your starter kit. You need that. If, you, yeah. if you're interested, that's the kit that you have to start um, with. And then we, we'll tell you about these two anti-aging products here. This is the eye cream. Uh, the eye cream here, which is a tiny little bottle, but it's, it's going to last you about a year. It does me, anyway. Yeah. You only need the tiniest amount. If I show you how little you need, probably about that much. It's a tiny, not even a bit of rice. And that's for both eyes. You squish your fingers together, and then you just dot it around the eye area and underneath. And then I just massage it in a little C. So I would be massaging in a C, going towards the bridge of the nose. This is the best anti-aging eye cream I've ever used. I noticed there's a difference within two weeks. Um, and what she's done, Susie goes around the world and she actually looks for a, what other people are doing out there. And then she copies them, comes back to the UK and formulates all her own products uh, in the beauty kitchen in Surrey. Okay. She's got two other ladies that help her do it now because she was on her own before. Um, so to speed it up, because we've gone from four, four products to seven when we started the company in 2013 and we've now got over 100. Yeah. So this product's got encapsulated vitamins in. So what that means is she's found a fruit wax, a natural fruit wax, that she puts the vitamins into. And then when they are in that cream and you start rub rubbing them, they melt into the skin. And vitamin C helps collagen, so yes. it makes your wrinkles less deep. So without a doubt, it helps the eye area not be so wrinkled. But it's also got hyaluronic acid in it, so it plumps the area too. It's 
wonderful. It's amazing. It's absolutely wonderful. It's amazing. Um, and then we've got this and one. And then we've got the night cream. I can't live with it. Because I'm old, 63. Not old. <laughs> um, I actually said I really could do with the night cream. Because the elixir oil is amazing. But I was using up the Skin Revive twice as quickly. So I was using it twice yeah. a day. Yes. So she's, she's, she actually helped uh, make this. And not just because I said it. Lots of other people did. The night repair cream is only £34. It's worth at least double that, in my opinion. In that cream, we have one of the most expensive ingredients that we use in, in the whole of the ingredient base. It's called Skin Ceramide Complex, Active Skin Ceramide Complex. It's £20,000 a bottle. Wow. The bottle's about that big and about that big. And I did try and ask HQ how big it was. She, they said about five litres, but I don't think they really knew. But it's not huge. Yeah. And it's £20,000 and it goes in the safe at night. Yeah, I don't blame them. So they use 3.4% of that in the night cream. So it's a very high percentage of this amazing ingredient. Just... And what that does, uh, if you imagine a brick wall, which is that the cells are our bricks and the cement is the glue that sticks it all together. Um, the ceramide complex is the glue. It's like okay. the mortar in a brick wall. Yeah. So as we get older, it starts to. We don't make as much of it. We make a lot of it as a baby. As you get older, the brick wall starts to fall down. Okay. Our faces start to get droopy. So this puts your mortar back in your wall. Ah, that's what I need. Repoints your wall. <laughs> it makes your skin firmer and it smells amazing. So this is a night cream. So I'm going to let you have a little snack okay. and on your lovely brown arm. So you don't need very much. It's a very rich, sort of slightly orangey colour. Nice. Um, and the it's got uh, aromatherapy essential oils in there to help oh, you sleep. Lovely. It's got cedarwood, ylang ylang. It's got a little bit of rosewood and rose, a little bit of lavender, but not too much, and oat, which is very soothing. Um, nice. But it's also got the hyaluronic acid. So again, it's got that plumping effect on your skin. So all of these products work together. They work in something called synergy, so that yeah. if you use the whole range together, that product will help that one. That product will help that one. That's why Susie puts the collections together to save you money because she wants you to try it to make sure you know exactly what that. Another thing that I do. found about our products, they're not heavy. You no. know when you wear like we've also got a makeup range. When you put makeup on or you don't no. feel like it's you're Doesn't wearing feel like anything. It's clogging your no, skin. no, it's not. not. It's not clogging your skin up at all. No, it's not. So um, it, yeah, they're really light to wear mm. um, and natural. I love them. Absolutely. Um, so there's three more things that I'm looking at that you haven't mentioned. Um, do you want to tell us about those? Because one of those I oh. really want to try. <laughs> <laughs> this is the one that yeah. I use. <laughs> right, these are our three face masks and they're £16 a pot. They will last you um, about four months if you use them once a week. Um, they will last the best before date. It's deliberately shorter. It's six months because okay. she uses really fresh ingredients in these. So um, we actually made face masks one, one time. Last year, we made our own face mask. We made a green one, which I called it yeah. Shrek, Shrek mask. And yeah, it's in, it I've Shrek. actually got it in my freezer because it's made of fresh ingredients. So oh, okay. I've actually got little bottles of it in my freezer. So this one is the most popular one. This is the top oh, yeah, seller. I've got that at home. This is great for teenage skin that's a bit sort of spotty and blemished, but it's also good at drawing out impurities from anyone. So in there, you've got this gorgeous bright green paste. Have a smell of that. Yeah, it smells good. To me, it smells like a spa. Yeah, it does. It's just But the wonderful. ABC kit, I actually think, smells like you've been to the An spa for the day. Spa. And you go there and you use it every day, so you just think... You yeah, get that lovely luxury, effect every day. Yeah. So what you do, once a week, you put this on, um, a layer all over your face, leave the eyes out, and leave it on for about 10 minutes. It dries, and it will leave your skin... Um, draw, it draws out all the impurities, yeah. it's got clay in there, it's got spirulina, it's got a little bit of tea tree oil in there, um, and rosemary, it's got a lot of rosemary, it smells amazing. So this product called Clear Skin, teenagers absolutely love it, people with spotty skin. I have skin. to say, I found it really easy, because normally when you put a face mask on, it's a real pain it's to easy get, get off. off. Yeah. So easy to take off. Yeah, they come off really easily, with a bamboo cloth. Yeah, really um, easy. So this, this, cre this, this mask here is definitely the best seller. Um, but you can do zoning. You can actually yeah. use this on your T-zone. You can put it on your forehead, nose and chin. And then if you want to, you can put different masks on other areas. Yeah. And a lot of people are doing that in beauty therapies now, okay. using different things. Because we all have different skin on our faces. Yeah. We're not usually just all one. So that's the first one. This one here, lovely for people who are of a certain age. Because <laughs> it's called <laughs> facelift. So facelift is, is yellow. It smells wonderful, I think. 
Absolutely. Oh yeah, so we show you that. So this is the sort of thing you can do with our face masks. You can, you can zone, zone them on different parts of your face. So being a facelift, for me, it would be forehead, because it tightens everything, yeah. and under here, <laughs> and down, down here. So I, I wouldn't put it on my nose, no. <clears throat> but it's really good for yeah. those areas. So it works virtually straight away. So you put a layer of that on. The yellow colour comes from turmeric and sea buckthorn, which is an orange berry, yeah. so it's very highly antioxidant. Turmeric is one of those superfoods, really good on your skin and inside your body. Yes. Um, it draws out impurities. The clay in there draws it out. But there's something else in there, <clears throat> which is something I've never heard of before, called electric daisy. Mm. So how that works, you know when you buy it on, if you've ever eaten a Kit Kat, yep. and you've eaten the silver foil, and you've got a mm -hmm. filling, yeah. it, it, it actually <laughs> makes you have a little uh, electric yeah. shock in your mouth. It's Horrible. Sort of, well, that electric shock is caused by uh, positive and negative. Okay. Uh, and that's what Electric Daisy has in the juice. It's a, okay. It forms like a little battery in your mouth if you eat it. Yeah. Now, you don't eat it. You no. put it on your skin. You don't feel anything. Okay. But what it does, it actually forms a little tightening effect on the skin. So you get positive and negative going wow. together. And it literally is a, like an instant fix. Okay. So, fantastic product. Really good if you're going out somewhere special and you want to just look amazing. Yeah. Use it just before you go out and your skin looks great. I have to get one of those. <laughs> this is the one I absolutely love, as well as that one. And this is called Deep Hydration Mask. It's purple. It smells like a fruit yogurt. A beautiful. Oh, really? I'm smell of that. Oh, yeah. Petit yeah, like a petit yeah, flu, does. like a cream. Uh, yeah. yeah. So it, it's a gel rather than a cream that okay. goes dry. It doesn't go dry. It doesn't go dry. You could leave it on your face and it just will always stay okay. there. Now what you do, you spread that over your face with your fingers or you can use a spatula. spatula. A little spa we do a lovely little spatula so you can actually spread it. So if I put that on your hand and you show the girls and boys, that it's not, um, it feels like a cooling gel. It does, really. So if you've got psoriasis, eczema, uh, acne rosacea, sensitive skin, this is the one for you. Um, because it's made for everyone, everyone yeah. can use it. It's a hydrating mask. So in there you've got a, a blend of gorgeous berries, a lot of them from Australia. Remember she came from Australia, yeah, yep, she went she there did. for a few years. So it's got things like Muntress berry, ribery, and blackberry and blueberry and raspberries and things like that. It smells amazing. I wish it really is probably one of the nicest things. Absolutely gorgeous. So what I do, I, I don't take it off. I basically just rub it in. Oh really? I leave it on my skin. If you if you rub it in, it goes like a white cream. So it goes a bit like a, you see what I mean there? It sort of goes yeah. a bit white. And then I leave it on 30 minutes and rub it in. Okay. And then I do something that I didn't know you could or not, but I did it anyway, because someone said try it and see what happens. Mm. I put a blob of night cream on top of it. Really? Oh my goodness me. It is amazing. And if you want to cheat, you can actually miss out the leaving it on bit, mix that together with the night cream and put it on and ah. go to bed. And it gives your skin a boost of um, hydration. Wow. There's a very weird thing in there. Um, there's a picture of it in the catalogue actually. It's on the corner of page 47, I think. Um, That'd be really good because you work in hospitals and your skin really dries yeah. out. Yeah, well I don't now. I did work in hospitals mm -hmm. for years, but there's central heating in people's yeah. homes. It really does dry your skin out. So in, in, on the page where the masks are, girls, there's a weird plant here called um, a resurrection plant, or the Rose of Jericho is another plant. And it's a desert plant, and it goes around the uh, desert. It looks like an old dried up root, and it looks like a dead piece of wood. And yet when the rain comes, um, it suddenly turns into that gorgeous green plant overnight. Yeah. I actually was sad enough to buy one off Amazon and try it. <laughs> so um, that plant there has got incredible regenerative properties and it's in that cream. Wow. So Susie said if it does okay. that for a plant, imagine if you put it in something and put it on your face. So without a doubt, this is a, a sort of elixir of life for me. So how much are they? Sixteen pounds each. Wow! So even if you did it as a mask once a week, yeah. and then did it maybe once or twice a week with the night cream, it's nothing, is it's it? It's nothing. It's about a pound a week to yeah. use it. It's really, really good. So I think that's most of the skincare range that you've spoken about. There's one thing that um, this is how I came to hear about Tropic. Um, I have terrible feet because I never wear shoes normally and so I've got really a hard dry skin on my feet and I've used everything, I mean everything to try and sort those out and um, this is the only thing that's ever, hand on heart, ever worked. Mm, fantastic um, isn't it? Do you want to tell us something? 
So you've got three products in the box and you actually get one of them free. Yeah. Um, if you don't want the box, you can buy it gi uh, eco. We do gifted and eco. And if you don't have the box, it's a pound cheaper. Okay. So this little kit is, I think, £22. Yeah. Um, and I think it's 23 with the box. You get a free foot fizz in it. So again... So I do this once a week, every Sunday. This is my... So it's a, a lovely white powder with tiny little brown flecks in it, and yeah. that's coconut ground up. The, the bit on the outside of the coconut okay. is ground there to exfoliate your feet. So what you do, you get a nice bowl of warm water, probably about an inch of warm water in it. Hot water actually is quite nice. Put about a dessert spoon in there. It fizzes like lemonade. And then you soak your feet for about 10 minutes. Yeah. And I do that when I'm watching television. Yes, me too. That's amazing. So it's called Walk on the Beach. And the reason it's called Walk on the Beach is... It's got, it's got something in it, and I, I can't show you this because it's not open, but um, it's a grey pebble stone. And it looks like a stone, but it's actually um, a, a, an artificial yes, pumice stone. Is, but in there you've got three things that are going, can I open it? Okay, it's not mine, but I'm going to open it. They're only eight pounds if you want to buy them separately. I leave mine in the shower. Do and you? I use it every day. And, and it really does work, doesn't it? So it looks like that, it's that sort of size. It fits your hand nicely. Yeah. So it smells fantastic. It smells like yeah. minty, minty, mm. peppermint yeah. sort of gorgeous. The colour grey is because it's got pumice stone in it, ground up pumice. Um, she uses sand from Bora Bora yes. and Tahiti, volcanic ash okay. and um, pumice stone from Italy. So she blends that and she actually gets it made into extru extrusion mould. It's forced into the mould, top and bottom, you see a little line around it, squashed down flat. Now, it's smooth and soft, but once you put it in water, you know yes. what happens. It foams yes. up it does. and it becomes like a rough pumice stone, yeah. but it smells amazing. So one, when you grate that on your feet, it gets rid of all it the dead really skin. It really does work. It's the best thing it's ever. It's fantastic. Um, so this one is the, the foot pebble, and then you have, to finish it off, when you've dried your feet, you have this wonderful um, foot remedy cream. And this has got uh, anti smelling you know deodorizing properties yeah it's got clay in it yep. and it's got things like eucalyptus peppermint oh it's amazing it is amazing it really really the active just... ingredients in there waterproof your foot and all the moisturizers go in so the best thing to do is put this on after you've done all of that and put a pair of socks on and yep. just sit and watch telly or go to bed in the socks whatever for about two hours yep. those those creams will be going into your feet there's five different butters in there um, it's fourteen pounds on its own, but you can buy it in this kit and get the foot fizz free. Five different body butters, starting with um, avocado, apricot. It's got a leafy, something called kokum, and something else called kupaku. Okay. And they get their, they get they start off very soft, and then they get harder and harder. And the leafy is like a big wax rock. Okay. And when you put that on, it waterproofs your foot and holds all the juices in while your it, skin moisturises. It really, just really, really works. Oh, I mean, amazing. I have really suffered and I've, re I've tried every cream, every, yeah. and it's the only thing. So this if you've got smelly feet, it's the only thing. It's going to stop that because it's deodorising yeah. as yes. well. It's really good. Talking about deodorising. Um, <laughs> yeah, now this, I remember I'm a nurse. I'm going to give you some inside information about what you can do with this. Okay. <laughs> right, large busted women, and there's a few of those out there, including me. <laughs> Um, will know that on, on a hot day you get a bit booby sweat going on yeah. and it can be feel really uncomfortable yes. can't it you feel yeah. sort of, and some people get red chafing yeah. the, the bra or the rubs and it's not very nice this is revolutionized that this is an, a deodorant for your armpits but you can use it anywhere that you over sweat yeah. so for me I literally it's a cream it's got a very clever um, way of applying it it's no rollerball she doesn't like uh, aerosols yeah. they're, they're toxic yeah so to the environment so she uses this cream so you squeeze it and the cream pops out three little holes there and then you literally can either wipe it under your armpit or you can do what i do and actually take that and i put about that much for two armpits and rub it in one on each yeah. side i then do the same and put it under my boots yeah. and then if you've got smelly feet i don't have actually sweaty yeah. smelly feet it's really good for those and I had a lady the other day, a lovely girl actually, one of my hostesses, and she said, I have got really sweaty hands. And it's a condition called hyperhidrosis. My, one of my really good friends had it, and it was a bane of her life when she was a little girl. Um, she didn't want to shake hands with people yeah. because her hands were always soaking wet. So she, I said, could you just try this? And I made her go like that and rub it on her hands. 
almost instantly could see what happened. It was like she just dried them completely and they just didn't keep sweating. Yes. And so she said, I'm going to trial it. So she bought it and she said, she actually put on my Facebook page the other day, I wow. can't believe the difference it's made. Okay. Just that simple thing. My scarf's Has off. it been tested on anybody? Um, we used it on the London Marathon runners. When it first came out last summer, um, we actually asked some of them to wear it. And at the end, we, they were holding their armpits up to be sniffed. <laughs> and they were fresh. And when I used it, when I was at the gym, I, I actually did something really minging. I wore it all day. Yeah. <laughs> then I didn't shower my armpits. And I went to the gym in the morning and did a workout. And then I didn't smell after oh, really? all of that. So it's not okay. even, it's more than 24 hours. How so it, what makes it work? Well, there's a few <laughs> chemicals, no chemicals in no there. No chemicals. Normally, um, deodorants have got other things and lots of chemicals in. One's got a lot of aluminium that makes your skin burn. Uh, okay. My son used to use it and he used to get red, really sore armpits. So we use a very gentle, um, large particle aluminium uh, chlorohydrate, which is perfectly safe and it's absolutely safe for anyone to use it. Okay. Um, we're allowed to use 25%, we only use six. Um, and what it does, it forms like a little cork in the end of the sweat gland and okay. stops sweat coming out of that gland for the day, which is why you can use it on any part of the body. Okay. So the sweat will come out somewhere else. A lot of people think it, it's got toxins in. Sweat is just water and salt okay. with there maybe a few hormones in it. So what this does, it stops that area of sweating. Um, the other active smell how nice it is. It is you? lovely. It's got ginger grass. It's got lemon grass. It's got things like rosemary oil. It's got clay which absorbs odors in it. So it keeps you dry, stops you smelling, and it's blooming marvelous. It is, and it's only ten pounds. And the fa whole family can use it. So whereas a roll-on, I wouldn't use my husband's roll-on, no. and he wouldn't use yeah, mine. Always... The whole everyone's got their own. Yes. This is one for everyone. Okay. It lasts me five months. Wow. And it's ten pounds. I use it every single day. That's amazing. Uh, and I use it elsewhere as well, as I said. <laughs> Um, so absolutely brilliant. One of my top selling products, it's only £10. I know it's not a sexy product to talk about, a deodorant, but my God, we all but need yeah, them. Yeah, we need them. There is nothing else in the world that stops you sweating like aluminium chlorohydrate. There is nothing out there. Okay. Some people say, oh, I wouldn't use that, it causes cancer. I've heard it causes Alzheimer's. Well, Susie won't use anything that hurts anyone yeah. as the ingredient. So she's done her due diligence, as did I as yeah. a nurse. So before I used it, I looked up and why, why, why is it safe? Aluminium chlorohydrate is absolutely fine. The Alzheimer's Society and the uh, cancer.org have okayed it. Okay. And so therefore it's completely safe. Yeah. Do your own medical research if you want, but that will come up. We're absolutely safe to use that one. We've got to tell them about this. We have. I don't want ladies watching. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really going, sorry for the men that are watching actually. <laughs> Too much information. Ladies need to be very careful what they use on certain parts of their body. Yes. Uh, because it can cause all sorts of problems yeah. like thrush and things like that. So all of our products, our body washes, our, our little cleansing bar, are pH balanced. And this is safe for any part of your body. Great for washing children as well. In there, can I open it? I love this, like opening a lovely, it's called body pebble. It's just come back into stock. This is made up in Preston actually, because they've got the moulds for it. So we give them the recipe and tell them what to use and they make it for us. So Tropic, it's got Tropic on it. And it looks like a soap, but it it's does, not yeah. a soap. It's like a solid body wash. Have a smell yeah. of that. Again, it's like it. peat, it's got lime and coconut in it. It's also got bits of oatmeal, which is really good for people with sensitive skin. Um, the the uh, product, la it works like a soap. You, you put it on and it lathers, yeah. but it's not soap. It's not soap. No, it's fantastic. It's only five pounds, one of our top selling products. It lasts for ages, actually. It does. If you don't leave it in a wet dish. Yes. But it lasts for ages and ages and ages, and it's good for any part of the body. So then are, those two things are great that stay yes. in my shower all the time. And they don't they go mushy. If no, they don't go mushy. If they're not, mushy, if they're not water, sat in any water no. and you keep them in a dry place. I'll leave place. them on my nail brush. Yeah. I'll leave that on the nail brush. So, it just sort so of keeps um, them yeah, I love them. But everything here is 100% natural, no chemicals. Um, There's only five products actually that are, they have a tiny bit of an, a synthetic um, preservative and it's think that this is one of them actually. Okay. Now um, what other preservatives like parabens are dangerous, we use one and a half percent in five products including the body washes of a preservative that's so gentle it's actually only rated a one okay. on the EWG website okay. um, and it's, it's you know really safe. Um, it's because of the cost of the ingredient that we use, the sterilising ingredient that we use in the skincare. If you think that's only however many mils, 50 mils, that's 200. Yeah. It would make that too expensive yes. if you put the, the basil yeah. and uh, oil and stuff in there. So we use that, but it's really effective. So this is one of our body washes. 
um, 10 pounds, we've got three of them, they look like fruit, and that's because they've got fruit in them. They smell amazing. This is lime, um, mints, wild mints and pineapple. Uh, this one is a mango steam, which is a lovely mango yeah, smelling lovely. fruit, uh, with thyme and mandarin, so it's like washing in lovely sort of fresh oranges. And then this one is a real sexy one that goes with that lovely oil, actually. That oil there, if you, if you use that oil, and yeah. that is as complementary, they complement each other perfectly. This is very girly and sensual. My, my husband Chiari. and the boys in my house use these for their body and they use it as shampoo. Yeah, this is a unisex product, the, the body wash. All of the products are, but men love these two in yes. particular. They last for ages. You can use them any part of the body, shower, hair, whatever, yeah. bit of shampoo. And um, they haven't got soap in them. So soap can be very dry. It's harmful. And, yeah. Yeah, we use soap berry and coconut coconut extracts to yeah. wash. So it makes a lovely foam. You do need one of those scrunchy things. Yeah. The scrunchies. Yeah, I know what you mean. Because if you don't, it doesn't foam up as much. Yeah. Because it still works, but it's wonderful and the whole family love it. And it goes on forever. So I think that's about our skincare range. Um, yeah. We, if anybody's interested or like the sound of the products and um, looking for part-time work, um, and do what we do drop me a message and I will explain about the business we're gonna do a live another day aren't we yes we for will. people that are interested in joining Tropic um, we also do home parties uh, if anybody wants to try these products out and actually get their hands on them and um, we can come to your home and we can do a party and the hostess will get a free facial and will earn 15% of the um, commission for all that's been sold that night we're also doing a workshop in reading um on the 19th if anybody's interested we're doing a makeup workshop and we're doing a skincare workshop now it's 10 pound you'll get tea and coffee and biscuits and you'll get a goodie bag as well so that will be at medeski stadium drop me a message if you want to hear about that um, we will do another uh, a makeup live another day because we've got so many products. But obviously, it's going to take too long to go through everything today. Yeah. I hope we haven't overfaced you with all the different information, but, <laughs> but um, it's a good chance to set, tell if, you all about if it. If you're interested and you like vegan, you like natural, if gluten you want free, gluten, gluten free, free. If you want to hear more um, about what other things um, chemicals do to your body. Google it, research it. We've all got Tropic pages. If anybody wants to follow us, your page is called? Um, it's actually Tropic Skincare and Makeup with Jenny Allen. And mine is Tropic 100% Natural by Liz. Um, so, but I will post those after the live. So if anybody wants to check out our, our Facebook pages, you can. Um, and I think that's about it. Yeah, thanks a lot Jenny Liz. I've really enjoyed telling you all about it I'm very passionate as you can probably tell yeah, um, you know a lot about your... I do train my team very well so you if do. you ever join if you join this team you're going to get very good training because yeah. I'm very passionate about the products and I think people just don't know what they're using I didn't know what I, I was didn't. using I honestly didn't it frightened know. me and when I found out no it is, it is um, and I think it's something you really need to learn not just for you for your for your children for your grandchildren um yeah you need to know so. what's going in your body on your body um and message us if you want to find out more if you want to know about any other products message me after and i will come back to you thanks for watching and Thank have you. a good evening bye 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 bye